starts. Well, the price is right, so now I gotta put the damn thing on the trailer. Come on, guys. This bit doesn't work unless you cross the road. Jesus, amateurs. It's my anniversary. I've never been punched yet, but today could be the day. See, with one flat tire, they tow all screwed up, but with two flat tires, they even out. It's the kind of advice you won't get everywhere. All right, that's gonna kill everybody in a three mile radius. All right, well, that was fun, kinda. I'm sure it'll all be fine. What am I looking at? Uh, I'm moving to Astoria. Yeah, new project for the channel. Something's missing. So this is what they're supposed to look like. I think the uh, curvy bedsides mean this is a series 250, I don't know, mid 50s, let's just say that. Mine's 48. Cap's the same. Little things are different. Yep, yeah, this one's well used. Interesting, the cab is cracked just like mine too. Oh, and uh, this one's got bubbles. The Ram is for scale. Oh good, it's still here. Huh. What is that awful noise? Something is very wrong here. Oh, I know why it won't start. Yeah, uh, she's a little crooked. However. <laughs> Sounds all right. Hey, weatherman! Why the hell it's sideways? Jesus! Well, this is fun. Well, churching up the 79 a little bit. Don't like that doesn't work because there are no wires. Red visors, stereo adapter, hood cable I gotta add. Oh, churched up the slant six truck too. This is definitely too nice. As you can see now, the uh, glove box door now matches and uh, I turned the truck into a Royal SE, whatever that means. Ah, huh. apparently this thing had a snow plow on it at some point in its life. California truck, metal, Good. Everything else, um, not so good. Washington truck, metal more of an idea. Soft parts, yeah, not bad. I can't really justify buying new things for this truck, but I can justify grabbing these. What a beautiful day. <laughs> Hey, uh, I think I found the problem. Body work. Is it? Actually, yes. Well, here's how this is going. It's, uh, better? Another day, another broken hunk of crap. But I'm almost done. Tie rod should not be quick disconnect. Dang it, didn't drive the demon today. Pretend that's a demon. Step side update. Cruise is awesome. 
Not bad. Mild vibration. I'm not worried yet. That's a precision fit. Putting the truck to work by loading the largest thing that possibly could have fit. It's a little warm today, so I just thought I'd go ahead and turn the heater off. Yep, there we go. You know, this wasn't like five minutes ago. Get a riding lawnmower, they said. It'll make your life so much easier, they said. Well, change the deck belt twice. Fix the uh, seized clutch bearing, so now the PTO control works. And repaired the belt tensioner on the deck belt, so maybe it'll hang together? Don't know. Let's see if I can mow for more than 45 seconds. Don't worry about that, that's fine. It's free all. Well, it does mow. Tell you what, feels completely un-American doing this without a beer in my hand. I'd have to fix that. I guess it's just gonna break every five minutes. Deck belt tensioner came loose again. Tight for good now. Hey, uh, where's all the gas? It's Saturday morning. I don't really feel like doing anything. What I should do is start digging a hole over there. Got some little projects on the demon going. I'm gonna put a factory upper hose back on, um, if it reaches. I'm stripping some of that plastic coating off of the wiring because I'm not a fan of that. I know it was done for dress up, but I'd rather be able to tell what's going on with the electrical system. And I'm gonna redo a few things and strip out some extra stuff I'm never gonna use, kind of clean it up. But what I'm gonna do now is make 340 noises. Yes. Mm -hmm. I love this thing. A little bit of light valve train noise on startup, but it always goes right away. Guess we can make small block Ford noises. That was sure starts easier. Put up a little racky thingy to start clearing some of this tall lumber building material crap out of the way. I was gonna do a nice job, but I ran out of screws. Gave the old owner four extra months to clear out this stuff, so. If his children need it, it'll be on the burn pile. Ugh, the dust is bad. Can you tell I've been working on this for an hour so far? Well, not a bad burn pile. Also, the dust has been awful. <clears throat> Most of that stuff, not gonna burn so well. Hey, I found a new gas tank for the power wagon. Of course, I could just clean the real one, but yeah. Yeah, driveway. Well, I've been at it for hours. It's better. I think I could move this saw over there and probably get both cars next to each other here. Went ahead and equipped the power wagon with the random gas can I found. I probably could have cleaned it out first, but uh, no, no. And the worst battery in the shop. It's a flathead, I'm sure it'll be fine. Ooh. Oh, come on. Really? Really? Oh. A greater truck has never been built. Look at all this room for activities. Nice.
Funny story. Yeah. My brother's duster was on fire right here once. God damn. Hey, if your lawnmower will run, but it won't rev up. Uh, it could be that. Seat's full of schmutz. Needle was covered in it too, before I dropped it. I don't even know what that is. Dead ants? Much better, actually. Look at all this room for activities. Now that is a precision parking job. The sun sets on a very productive day at the old Dead Dodge garage. And everything smells like grass cuppings. But it could be worse. A guy could get used to this. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Solid rain. Out of nowhere. It's good content.